Hello, welcome to more Wind Waker Mondays. Well, this isn't going to be released on Monday. I'm actually filming this on Sunday. I'm releasing it today on Sunday, but this was going to be meant for Monday. Um, I usually film Wind Waker two days or ahead of the ahead of the day of, and then edit it. But I just woke up and I seen a comment <laughs> saying, "I'm waiting for Wind Waker." I'm like, "Oh shit!" I actually put Wind Waker on hiatus. Um, I was going to film this and I was going to film some more tomorrow and just film the whole week. That way I have Wind Waker coming out every week for all of no, February, for all of February. That's why I was going to be on hiatus. I was actually going to make a whole bunch of Wind Waker and then just have it come out during the whole month. You know what I mean? But uh, this guy wanted it right away. So I'm going to film it as soon as I wake up. Like I just got up I'm here now. Let's do it. <laughs> Anyways, uh, to give a brief recap, we just finished the Forest of Haven or whatever. We got the pearl from him or the treasure from the Great Dugu Tree. And now we have to go south, I believe, I think, or east. Is it south or east? Either one, we have to go to another uh, place and get something there. Also, make sure to like and subscribe. My name is Sin K. Call me Sin for short. Sorry, I didn't say that right away. I was just so excited. Anyways, let's just jump right back into it. Let's, let's get on the seas. We actually have to go west first. So, the place we're going is like northwest. The place we're going is like northwest. We're going to go west first a few, a little bit, and then we're going to go up north. I would go northwest the whole way, but I'm too scared. What if I find something that will just destroy me? You know, I wish this was a quicker way to swim. Or to make the boat go faster. Then again, I do enjoy these boat rides. What is that? Sorry, I get distracted out here. I actually want to see what's in here. That's new. That's a blue slime. A blue chew jelly. Ah. I can't break this. Well, there's really nothing for me here. I just wanted to see what that was. Oh, it's just Mr. Fishy. Yeah, Mr. Fishy. I have some bait for you. Hey, hoy, small fry. Yeah, yeah, I've heard. Take it, you want to chart information about this island? Then start by opening up your sea chart. Hmm. Listen up, small fry. This is between you and you. On Onsat Island, buried beneath the black soil, there's some mysterious treasure. Some serious treasure. I know it sounds like I'm trying to pull your leg, but I'm serious. Try digging there. What? You haven't got anything to dig with? I say try using an animal or something. Work smarter, not harder, small fry. And that's all the info I've got to offer. If you want to hear it again, you'll have to throw some more bait on the water for me. Sorry, but that's my policy, fry. Can't go fighting you on an empty stomach, you know. And with that, I'm off. Wow, he's greedy, isn't he? Oh, shit. What the fuck? I don't have anything to fight them with. I have a boomerang, but I don't think a boomerang will do anything, would it? Alright, now we have to go north. Let us head north! I am terrified right now. What is that? Oh shit. I don't have anything against that. Is that, is that our destination there? An island in the distance? Boy, I think we made it. Yeah, it looks like this is it. Hey. Look, Linkle, do you see it? What is that to this place? Great Fish Isle. Oh my god. 
What is the meaning of this? The island, it is. We are too late. I knew we had precious little time, but I never suspected how little. A great water spirit named Juban once lived here, but no sign of him remains. Oh, there, Linkle. Oh, wow, you're brave. So you're here. I've been looking for you. Are you by chance seeking the great spirit, Jaboon? I'm sorry to report to you that Juban can no longer be found here. Just look at how this place has been torn to pieces. So I suppose this too is the work of the shadow in the forsaken fortress. But fear not, Juban was able to flee this island before it, was before it was attacked. He is in a safe abode now. We'd like to guess where that abode may be. On the island where you were born on outset. Yet even if you were able to go to outset now, you will not be able to see Juban. Cave where he hides a sealed with a mighty stone slab that repels all who try to pass it. Why not even the pirates with their mighty ship could get in? I must apologize, Linkle. I thought if anyone would know of your whereabouts, it would be the pirates. I told them that this tale without so much as a thought for the consequences. I don't know what they hope to get, but they immediately set sail for Outset Island and tried to break into the cave. <laughs> it was lucky they could not gain entrance. I have heard that they were last spotted on Windfall Island, but doing, but doing what? I do not know. If you wish to see Javoon, I think you'd better search for the pirates on Windfall Island. What an eerie island, isle this is. Everywhere else boasts clear skies and calm seas, but this place suffers under dark clouds and rain. Valu must be right. Must have been right when he asked me to bring the word of Jaboon to you. He called this island cursed. Oh shit. I would counsel against staying here longer than you have to. But that is your decision. I've told you of Jaboon, so my task is complete. Alright. Huh, what is on this island? Is there anything worth noting? So Jaboon has survived. The spirit, the sea spirit has lived through the trials of many long years. He must have caught wind of Ganon's attack beforehand. We are able to believe the words of the Rito Postman that the pirates know something about the cave where Jaboon hides. Why don't we go to go first to Windfall and search for them there? Okay. Great, now we gotta go to Windfall Island. If anybody knows about this island and what I can do there, please comment below. Like I said, this is my first time playing and all that. I, w I would love to have any advice, you know. Glitches, maybe. Like, if the glitch is not something I would... Like, a duplicating thing, I would not do. Something that's, like, worth my time. That's cool, you know what I mean? Like, even silly glitches. Like, as long as they don't break my progress or break the game, you know. Is that a shark? This is not good. Is he gonna follow me? What the fuck? Bro, no way is he gonna, he's gonna follow me. Fuck, he already hit me. Oh! Don't follow me. <laughs> Leave me alone. I'm pretty. Wait a minute. I wonder. Oh. Why didn't I do that before? Okay, we are here. Actually, oh, it is just as the postman told us. The pious ship has stopped here to avoid drawing the attention of the townsfolk. I know, I know not what they are researching, but if they are hoping to get their hands on Javoon's sacred gem, I doubt they would tell you anything directly if you were to ask them. Linkle, I think you should try to find out what the pirates are up to without them finding out about you. All right, a sneaky mission. Oh wait, we have mail. We just got a letter. We just got a letter. I wonder who it's from. Show me. You wish to be a true swordswoman. From find some knight's chests, crests, and return to me, Orca. Yay! Now let's see what's on the boat. Who's all on the boat? Oh, I didn't even read it. Uh. Oh, crap. What did he say? I can sail upon the water or be filled with it. I am a bottle? 
Okay, he's not a bottle. Underwater, we fill with a bucket, right? Nah, scram non pirate. No. Ah, God. I'll figure it out. We're close today, so scram now. What? Okay, we're gonna go up here and then see what they're doing. Oh, they are in here! Oh, they're stealing the bombs! <laughs> That's like pirates should do. Look, don't be mad at us. It's not our fault that we absolutely gotta have bombs to get the treasure after. How about you just think of it as payback for the nasty little monopoly you've been running here? What did you think it was foolhardy to ask Christ to pay such an outrageous price, huh? Yep, I bet you are. You know, Gonzo, I still can't get over that bit of fast talk he pulled to get that information out of the postman. Oh, oh yeah, that was smooth. I tell you, the minute I set my eyes on Linko, I knew he was hiding something. I just knew he was hiding something back at outset, yeah? So when I saw that postman, I just pretended like I was all worried about the kid and stuff. And presto, he spills the beans. Good work, Gonzo. Really, just top notch. It's funny, though. I'm thinking this is maybe the first time you've shown such wit, such cunning. You know, with your cunning and Miss Tetra's smarts, if you two got married and had a kid, that kid would be the greatest pirate to ever see. Hell, see, he's yet the greatest. You idiot, keep your mouth. Let's <laughs> show ya. Hope he's not stupid. <laughs> Mr. Tetra, are listening to this nitwit? Can't you dock him some pay or something? Quit goofing off, both of you. <laughs> Keep your childish jokes to yourselves and get those bombs back to the ship. The second you're done loading up, we're setting sail for Outset Island. Ah. What, miss? We have to leave immediately, but it's been so long since we've been on since we were on shore. Oh god. We need to fill our bellies with some good eating, yeah? How about we grub tonight and shove off tomorrow morning instead? I mean, uh, I'm fine either way, of course. Whatever you say is fine, miss, is what I mean to say. Oh, my God. It's just that the boys were so excited to come to town, yeah? I can't help but think it would be awful on them. It would be awful hard on them to leave so soon without a proper left layover. So what? <laughs> so what say we set sail tomorrow, yeah? What do you say, miss? That treasure isn't going anywhere. You're with me, right, boys? Who's for a night of fun? You're all fools, you know that? You saw that demolished island. You saw the senseless destruction. We have to hurry on to outset, or the same thing could happen there. Huh? huh? Not to be disrespectful, but by the sound of things, you're worried more about, more about that island than the treasure, miss. Don't be ridiculous. Don't be ridiculous. I want you to know the treasure. Alright, fine, have it your way. We can leave town tomorrow, you big babies. But we're setting sail at first light, so no sleeping in, understood? Please. Aye, aye! <laughs> Say that, brother. What was today's password again? Mac, are you serious? You forgot already? You're so useless. Today's password is Schooner? Yeah, remember. You know that? You know what? You know that Nico won't let you in if you don't say it exactly right, and he's really picky about it, so I'll say it once more. Today's password is Schooner. Yeah? Schooner. Alright. Yeah. We're here. Oh, well, I can't, ha I can't save you. I'm sorry about that. Oops. Well, since I can't save him, and I thought I could grab the bombs, but never mind. We're gonna get back onto the ship. This time I have the password. He is a schooner. Oh shit, I spelled it wrong. What? Oh no. What was it again? Oh man, 
This is embarrassing. I forgot already. I should have wrote it down. Shit. Alright. I think I know it now. I had to fucking rewatch the footage. Uh. What? It's not that? What is it then? Alright, alright. Is it treasure? Does the spelling matter? Is that is that it? The spelling matters! It's case sensitive! Fuck! <laughs> oh my god, I feel so stupid. Are we supposed to be in here? Right now what? Oh, it's Nico. Oh, Linkle, my old swabby. Linkle, so you're alive. <laughs> All the other pirates said you got done in by that bird monster in the Forsaken Fortress. So I thought, never mind what I thought. You're alive. <laughs> oh, I get it. Now you came back because you missed me so much. Right. I had no idea you wanted to be my swabby so badly. I see, I see. Well, after you left, I went back to being the bottom rung on the ladder, which is why I'm stuck here while everyone else is in town having fun and eating and stuff. But I guess being so worshipped by my swabby had to cheer me up. All right, why don't we set you set you to your next test, huh? This one is harder than the last. Good luck. You'll need it, swabby. As you can see, there are lanterns hanging throughout the room, right? Well, last time when you were pressed, the platforms rose up through you. Just oh, okay, which means you have to jump from one up to the next one. Pretty tough. This time I put a gate on this door too. So the switch opens the gate, but it'll close if you don't get there before time. Okay. Wow. The switch that opens the gate is in the same place as before, so go step on it. If you get all the way to this inside before, I'll give you the bombs we got in town. Yeah, you heard me. Give it your best shot, Swabby. All this for bombs, eh? Alright. Oh man. Oh man, I need to come on. I wasn't supposed to make that, but all right. I don't have much time. Come on. Come on, I don't have much time. Yeah, we did it. What? You gotta be... You did it already? <laughs> you're, you're incredible. This isn't good. I never even passed this test. How could she do it so quickly and make it look so easy? If I give this to her, everyone will know for sure. I'll be so busted. Oh, okay. You're the best Bobby of all time, so I guess I'll just give you the bombs. Go on, take them. <laughs> just don't tell anyone, okay? I'm serious. Really, really serious, okay? Okay? Wow. Well, at least he's staying true to his word, you know? You got bombs, you can carry up 30. Pull one out and press. Okay, try it out. Using all your pokers, do a mighty can. You can use the fight off scene. Oh, sweet! That's mighty courageous of you trying to steal treasure from pirates. I suppose I should be shocked, but I'm more amazed that you managed to survive after being tossed out of that tower. From the look on your face, I have to guess you haven't saved your sister yet. You don't give things much thought, do you? You just rush in, never thinking how badly things could go for you. Like just now, the only reason you got what you did was because we left a simple-minded little rat like Nico behind to look after things. And no one else would have parted with our treasure so easily, I assure you. And just how do you intend to use those bombs anyway? Don't tell him you're going after Jaboon's treasure too. Right now, Jaboon is hiding in a cave at the back of the island you were born on. But the entrance is blocked by a giant do stone doorway. You can't get in without breaking down the door. We're going to relax in town and eat our fill of whatever this town has to offer, but we'll be leaving for Outset Island first thing in the morning. If you manage to find Jaboon tonight, then I guess you win. But if you take too long, we'll come sailing right by you tomorrow morning. And believe me, all you didn't get all of our bombs. You'd better be quick, kid. Thank you, Nico. How oh, awesome. You have a stone just like that. The one that Miss Tetra has. Hey, do you, how do you use that thing? Can you talk to Miss Tetra through that? Man, you're so lucky. Oh my god. Confirmed, Nico is a simp. He's a simp. But at the end of the day, aren't we all simps? Alright, let's let's go to the outside island now. 
Pam para pam 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 pam. Where the fuck's my boat? Oh, there he is. Good evening. Letters for Linko. We have one letter. Here is your letter. Notice from Beale Shop Ship. Time for our seminal big chance extravaganza. Extravaganza. We have a new product. The one person to see bombs. We have an extra special sale on the choice for you. Oh, okay. Beale chart. You know where to find this little ship. So open the chart. Oh. Okay, now we have bombs. All right, I just had to buy something. Well done. Our preparations are complete. If what the girl says is true, the pirates won't be leaving until tomorrow morning. You must meet with Jaboon and then get the pearl from him before they arrive. Let us delay no longer, Linkle. All right, then. Let's go. First, we got to make sure the wind is going that way. So what happened is I, I put it west when I meant to put it south, so I made us go south. I, I just uh, feel stupid. Let's see what we get. It's gonna be a rupee. Oh, little purple rupee, I kinda guessed. Oh shit, I'm not paying attention. Don't worry, they're not good. No fucking way. Are they gonna follow me the whole way, bro? I am terrible at this. There we go. Dude, there's so many. We gotta go. I can't deal with these guys right now. What the fuck is this bullshit, man? I don't have enough bombs for this crap. Please. I'm just the man on a mission right now. Holy fuck. We're almost there, we're almost to outside island. Alright, we have treasure. I wanna see what we get. Let's see, let's see, show me, show me. A rupee. I figured. Oh, 500 is our max? I didn't know that. There it is. There's the island where we were born. We've made it. If you notice, Nickel, morning has not been broken since we arrived at Great Fish Isle. The land that was so ravaged by monster by monsters, it is as time itself is frozen. Perhaps this is the curse that Valu spoke of. Whatever the reason, if this night does not end, we do not need to worry about the pirates overtaking us. In fact, it might be a bad idea for you to visit your hometown and family again after such a long time away. We can speak with Japoon after you do. Alright. I want to see how Granny's doing. Granny, I've been gone for so long. <gasps> there she is, knitting away. Oh, she's not even knitting. Oh, uh... Linko, Ariel, don't go, don't leave, uh, don't leave your poor old grandma. Aw, all alone. Aww. Aww. Aww, that makes me miss my grandma. Hey, Orca, you sent me a letter, Master Orca. Oh, Linko, you are all right. Why did you not tell me about Ariel? That was thoughtless of you. This island has been in hard times ever since you departed. Do you not know what you have been doing on your journey, but you seem a little more daring these days. The look in your eye is not the one you left here with. Very good. Show me just how much you've improved your sword skills. Okay.
But I must say so, your skills with the sword are still at the level of a page. Very good, try hit me a number of times or more before I hit you. No way. No, he's so fast with it too. Bruh. Again. Again. I remember that you were... No, we're doing that again. We're doing that again. I do. She didn't go through again. Wow, Got him uh, past the hundred, motherfucker. Let's see how far I can go without getting hit. He got me. Fuck. Ah, oh, 145 blows. You have improved. I guess it was wrong of me to treat you like you're a little lowly page. You are a page no more. You are now a knight. A knight. It is not much, but it is now yours. Take this with you. A rupee that I can't really use. <laughs> hey. That's all? Well. Who's up here? Let's go see who's up here. Oh, it is you guys. Is is that you, Linkle? Well, looks like looks as though you're safe. That's good to know. Your grandmother at oh, all. Don't even tell me about my grandmother, right? She's being, <coughs> she rarely leaves the house, and as far as I can tell, she spends her days sleeping. She hardly eats. Aw, what? I've actually come here to see if my old grandpa knows of any medicine or anything that might come that make her feel better. Well, oh, Uncle, you've come back, and in one piece, too. Gracious, my granddaughter tells me that your grandmother's in poor health these days. Now, I'm certain that little fairy dust would provide all the lift her spirits need. But, well, the problem is I haven't seen any fairies in these parts recently. Of course, long ago, you can find a lot of them by the old fairy fountain, and you could even catch them in an empty ball. Sure, it was easy as you please. Yes, there was a time when I used to like playing with fairies. Uh, uh -huh. In any case, ever since the fountain was blocked by that huge rock, I haven't seen one. Oh man. Well, we gotta help Granny. 
All right, where's this huge rock everyone speaks of? Are you ready? If that is the case, then we must search for the cave around the back side of Outside Island, which Moon is side to hide. All right. He's around here, eh, you say? Oh, what the fuck? Oh. What is happening? What is this? Do we shoot this? Oh, we do shoot it. Okay. All right. All right. I don't have much bombs left. Oh, yeah. We did it. Nice. I thought I didn't have enough bombs. <gasps> Let's go see a Jaboon! Oh, he really is a spirit. Oh, what the fuck? <gasps> Fish. Fish. He a big boy. Well met indeed, Jaboon. I am pleased to see that you are safe. I don't... I don't speak well. Yes, it seems Ganon has returned. There can be no other explanation. Oh. Unfortunately, that is not so. The one I have brought with me has no connection to the legendary one. And yet, I sense great promise in the courage that this one possesses. I do. It is the only way. Oh. oh. That was easy. Didn't have to do a dungeon or anything. You got Nehru's Pearl. The water spear Jaboon was kind of to be this jewel. A treasure of one of the goddesses. Bye bye, Jaboon. So that foul rain and endless night were indeed elements of a curse brought us on by Ganon. He must intend to cast this land into pure darkness for all time. I believe I have. Bye bye. Bye, Mr. Boom. What a big fish. Ganon's curse has been broken by the power of the pearl that Jaboon gave us, so morning should come soon. It is well that we have gathered all of the pearls. Are you ready, Linko? I have marked the places where you must set the pearls on your sea chart. Once you have placed each of the pearls in its proper location, the program grounds for your courage will become apparent. Clearly, the search for Jaboon has shown that Ganon has begun to make efforts to block our path forward. It is certain that the pearls, that the perils ahead <laughs> will be greater than any of you have faced thus far. You should finish any business you have here on Outside Island right now so that you shall not have any regrets later. Alright, people, that is where I'm going to leave this episode from Wind Waker. Um, I'll catch you guys all next week. You know, I'm going to try my best to have Wind Waker out every week, once a week. You know, keep the series going. It's still going to be Mondays. Maybe occasional Fridays if, you know, the, if it starts to pick up, like if I start to get more views for the series and there's more demand. Remember, you just got to ask and I'll do it. You know what I mean? Even just one comment because I'm a small channel, right? I, I value entertaining even if it's just one person, you know, I enjoy it. And I've never played this game like from start to finish. I said that before in the past. But again, any advice is appreciated. Any funny things you guys know of or little glitches here and there. Something that isn't like exploitive. Something that's just fun to do. You know what I mean? I would definitely try it out. Um, Easter eggs especially. Don't give away any spoilers for me. I will not. I will probably delete comment of spoilers. Just don't spoil me for anything. Any story elements. This is a real ride for me. Anyways, without further ado, bye bye. Smell you later. Make sure to clean your gitch today. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye.